Hey guys, okay, another one. This one will do um, <sighs> pump maintenance. And somebody said I'm really interested in pump maintenance. How often do you clean it, change parts, etc.? So um, as far as pump maintenance goes, as far as the actual pump, there really is no maintenance. It's if you have, um, and I'm speaking with the Medela um, pump and style. So I cleaned, there's really no, you don't actually clean the actual pump. As far as the tube goes, the tubing goes, um, which are these bad boys right here, the tubes, you can run, so there's a few different ways to tube, clean them. You can steam them, like in your microwave steam bag. You can um, run hot water through them. You can run, I think, like alcohol and then rinse with water, or alcohol dries them faster. Um, there's really a bunch of different like ways to clean them. I've only ever cleaned them a couple times. So, and after, oh, my cat attacked him and punched, punched a hole in them, so I had to buy new tubes. It's about five bucks a tube here. So, um, and that was from the local hospital. But as far as cleaning them goes, it's not that often when you get moisture in them, what you can do is just leave your pump running for a little bit and um, it will obviously dry them out takes a little bit but it'll dry them out because the air is going back and forth the biggest thing is just to keep them dry in the first place and um, and you'll be all set milk doesn't go through them or anything like that it's just um, sometimes a little bit of condensation gets in there and that's when you just leave your pump on let them air out let them dry out and you're good to go but um, yeah I clean them every couple of months or so let's see as far as changing the parts go I assume you're talking let me put it together right I assume you're talking about these parts. Um, I change them for every single pumping. I would, um, I like them clean, except for during the day. I would leave them in the fridge. Um, and if I was in my car, I'd leave them in ice packs so they stayed ice cold. So it was just like I was refrigerating the milk. But that was in them. Um, because I didn't have, I had three sets of pump, three sets of pump parts. I used one set in the morning, one set three times during the day, and then one set at night. And um, like I said, during the day, I would just keep them cold in the fridge or in the cooler just so like um, I was refrigerating the milk. But you use a new one every time or you keep them in the fridge and then you can use them again. But it's, if it's cold, put them on. Um, as far as cleaning them goes, for the first six month of his, months of his life, I put everything in the micro sterilizer in the microwave. My Dr. Brown's one, I showed it in one of my videos. And um, it was kind of tedious because we hand washed everything. And it's very important too that you take off this valve. It comes off. If it's stuck on there really, really good, because sometimes they get on there good, sometimes if you rock them back and forth, don't use your teeth to pull it off, lesson learned. <laughs> but um, if you rock it back and forth, then you're able to get it off and obviously to twist it. So, and you want to be careful not to mess with this membrane because if it gets torn or anything like that, you're going to lose suction. So, and as far as the membranes go, the only time I ever replace them is when they cracked or they broke, and I think that's just from, obviously, you know, wear and tear, but otherwise they stay on pretty good. Um, so, yeah, and as far as cleaning goes now, I just take the, um, the valve off and I throw it in the, the little basket in the bottom of the dishwasher, set the bottles, and I find they get, like, perfectly clean, not that they don't get clean on the top rack, because we have a, a washer on the top rack, but they get really, like so 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 clean not even spotty on the bottom rack and so I put everything on the bottom it works in our dishwasher but also we don't use a heated dry on our dishwasher um so let me know if you guys have any more questions about that because I'd be more than happy to answer it I know that was that was something challenging for me to understand in the beginning but um after you do it a couple times it's just like a piece of cake so anyways um let me know bye guys